Six out of ten children in Singapore are not eating whole grain. Is your child one of them? Introducing the Sing Grain Study. A nationwide survey conducted by Newcastle University International to study whole grain eating patterns in Singapore's children aged 6 to 12. And what the study revealed was eye-opening. But wait, what's so special about whole grain? Whole grain contains all three main parts of the grain, thus providing a full pack of nutrition. They provide more B vitamins, iron, and protein besides being a rich source of fiber. Whole grain consumption has been associated with reduced risk of heart disease, diabetes, and weight gain. But in spite of all these benefits, the study shows that 94% of children are still not getting the recommended daily intake of whole grain. And as these children get older, their whole grain consumption further declines. Diving deeper, we discovered that most whole grain was consumed at breakfast, and the top contributors were noodles, bread, and breakfast cereals. One easy way of reversing the trend is to simply start the day with breakfast cereals that have whole grain as their number one ingredient. And make sure to look out for logos and labeling information that highlight whole grain. So start your kids on a breakfast habit today with whole grain.